in my never-ending pursuit to find the nicest RVs in the world, we hit the jackpot today and found this rare Newmar Ventana that has two full bedrooms. Lance, you were telling me this is one of four in the world? Yeah, so what's really nice about this, Newmar uh, made just four of these, and they're gonna be tri two separate bedrooms completely. This is a 2022 Newmar Ventana? No, this is gonna be a 2021. So this is gonna be used. It is in like new condition. And I mean, there's just a lot of neat features to it. You're gonna have tag axle. It actually turns with the coach, help eliminate a lot of your wheel scrub. And I'm hanging out at Transwest RV here in Belton, Missouri. Now, we are doing a bunch of sponsored videos. We just filmed the 2022 King Air. Now, this particular coach was not on the lineup to video, but once I saw it, I had to get you guys a look at this two bedroom coach. But I wanna give a huge thanks to RV Snap Pad for sponsoring today's video. RV Snap Pad is the world's only permanent jack pad. If you own a fifth wheel motorhome travel trailer or truck camper, this is definitely a product you want to check out. Snap pads are made to snap into your levelers or stabilizer system and stay there for good. With snap pads installed, your RV will benefit from increased stability and protection for each landing foot. No more sinking into soft surfaces and you don't have to climb under your rig to retrieve your jack pads either. We've partnered with snap pad to offer our viewers a special discount on a set of snap pads. Simply click the link in the description below, submit your RV info, and get an instant snap pad recommendation for your rig. Then you can use the coupon code in the description below for a 10% discount. RV snap pads are made in the USA and give a special thanks to all of the veterans and first responders. All right, Lance, you think we can take a look inside or? Uh... Yeah, let's just take a really quick peek inside. Um, as we're going in, I want you guys to notice too, uh, this is going to have a lot of the integrated awnings that go to our Nova awnings that It'll come out, drop down. So some of those nice higher end features that you would see like in your Dutch stars and uh, it's just nice to be able to have that. It's going to have the 400 horsepower Cummins motor, but and it's going to be sitting on a Freightliner chassis and it's gonna give you all the power you need to get you, your family, and whatever you're towing behind this coach up the hill. Yeah, this is a tag axle coach. It's got the emergency egress door. And do you know how many miles are on this coach and how much dough are you guys asking for it? So um, it's gonna have about 7,000 miles on it. So like new condition, we're gonna be just about 364,000, 364,805, I think is what we're, what we're asking. Well, I wanna see inside of this coach. I'm excited about this one. So this is a triple slide coach, and I have been inside of thousands of motorized RVs. I've never seen a diesel pusher with two full bedrooms. I'm excited about this one. Have, hey. have you ever seen anything with two full bedrooms? No, nope. I've been doing it for 13 years, and I've actually never seen nothing like it. And uh, to my knowledge, Newmar has only built four of these. So there's only four in existence. We got one of them. The nice thing about this particular one, we've only got about 7,000 miles on it. So she is in like new condition. Uh, when you get in there, if you look at the paint, it's flawless. You don't see tree branch scratches. I mean, it's got a beautiful finish to it. And uh, just some of the nice features. We'll highlight just a few of them here on the outside. But you yeah. guys, it's all about that inside. And we're gonna get, we're gonna, we're gonna show that to you in just a second. But I just want to point out real quick, they, the previous customer had window awnings put on there. So you got an awning for each window. You've got a really nice emergency egress door. So this is the 4329 floor plan. We do have the generator running right now, so there's a little bit of background noise. We're right along the highway. A lot of good looking coaches here, but yeah. let's she see. is smoking hot today, guys. So <laughs> we definitely want those ACs working. Um, before we get in there, I just want to point out, we do have a keyless entry in there. So if you've got some grandkids, and they don't have keys, you just give them the code and they can get into the coach. So, very nice. You've got some nice little storage areas here. Um, this one's a nice deep one, so if you want maybe bags of dog food or, you know, kids' shoes, whatever, just a nice place to throw yeah. some extra shoes. It's extra storage, so. De right. Yeah, definitely a family coach here. So, bring the dogs, bring the kids. And the first thing I'm noticing is these captain's chairs have the two-tone piping with the cream leather absolutely stunning and then it's on the freightliner chassis it does have the digital dash up here and this is with the generator running and the acs running right now so lance what's going on in here okay well um well welcome to the inside of this beautiful ventana it's 4329 model so basically your 43 foot 29 is the model 
and uh, 43 feet long uh, 43 I would say 43 foot 10 inches okay almost so, 44 mm -hmm. just some nice creature comforts for people who want to you know they're getting ready to head off to their trips uh, you're gonna have a nice wireless charging system here for your phone and uh, what's really kind of nice is this little table here uh, if you've got some uh, friends family grandkids hey do your homework maybe do a little work away from home you can do that very comfortably from this seat. You also have uh, another wireless charging system right here. So nice. once that lights up, it's letting you know that it's charging your phone. Um, and then just a lot of other little neat features. Guys, I'll go more into detail here about this cockpit. All you gotta do is call me, we'll do a FaceTime video. But I wanna get onto this, this part here because this is what makes this coach. It's absolutely gorgeous. Let's turn on some lights here for y'all. Yeah, All right. stunning, nice light colors in here very neutral oh you can turn those back on all right so those seats spin right around very effortless and uh i gotta swing around here to give everybody a perspective of the mm -hmm. seating in this coach so uh does this couch turn into sleeping at all yeah this will make into a bed that'll make into a bed so you've got one two three you probably put four here five six seven eight nine ten and then you've got these nice little guys too you've got a couple of these where you can sit a couple uh, little ones if you needed to. And do but those have storage as well? They do. Let's open this guy up here. Yeah, beautiful floors so in this coach too. You can flip it around. It's got the hard surface on one side, and then if you want it for your legs, a little bit more comfort or just to sit down on. Yeah, let's take a look here. Yeah, boom! All villa. And I love these floors here. They're almost between a matte and a high gloss. Would you call that high gloss or is that matte? No, it's a, it's a mix. So you've got some you got some you got some uh, gloss with a little bit of matte finish mix. So it's it's a little unusual. Usually it's either gloss or it's matte, but to have to have them married up. I really, like it. Really, I like really it. Unique. We got a lot of sitting up here. Now, uh, what kind of sleeping do we have up here? Before okay. we go, I can't believe there's two more bedrooms in this coach. This is unbelievable. So really nice sleeping. Um, but what I like is, so the captain or the uh, recliner chair, this is a recliner chair, this is a recliner chair. But what I like about this is when you guys are getting ready to watch a movie, you're sitting down, you're facing your TV, right? But then, let's say you want to call it a night, the kiddos want to, you know, it's time for them to go to bed, but maybe you're just going to put a movie on, maybe a little white noise for the kids. Um, this will actually come out nice little height of bed. Yeah, all villa furniture. And you still got some walking area yep. here to get through the coach. Yeah, very nice, very comfortable. Um, you got some nice storage there. So again, bringing family and friends is important to have that storage, right? So, I mean, anywhere you could put a cabinet, they try to put a cabinet because they know just how important it is to actually have storage for everybody. So, but to put it away, I mean, it's pretty easy. It really doesn't take any effort at all. So somebody, and I'm sure if you guys have ever rv it's a pretty simple task. You only gotta do it once or twice and you end up becoming a pro at it. <laughs> That's it. Uh, now, is this TV on a televator there? Yes, it is. So what I like about the way that this is set up, now most of the time, let's say with other, other coaches out there, if your TV's there, you have to give up your window. But what I like about Newmar, one push of a button, TV goes down, and so while you're here eating, right, this is gonna be patio side. This is where you're gonna see all your family and friends. So you can be here having a nice meal, and you still have your window, and you can keep track of what's going on outside. Yeah, absolutely. You've got uh, a 110 outlet with a couple USB ports here at the end. Got a really nice Bose sound bar there. DVD. So if you want to uh, plug in a movie for the kids as you're going down the road, fantastic. Yeah, and then I noticed too, uh, outlets and USB ports there, or outlets here on uh, both sides of the couch here, and then you're gonna have some USB ports over on this side, and this coach is in excellent condition, but what's going on in this galley? I know everyone wants to see those two bedrooms, but uh, yes. we're, we're almost there. What's you going on in the galley? The galley? I want this, this is something I think, because if you're gonna have a family come with you, I think it's important to keep everybody cool or else we start getting an unhappy mama, unhappy kids. We don't want that. If you look at the way that this is designed, this is what we call comfort air. So when the slides are closed, right, instead of having your vents out here on the outer edge, you're not just cooling the tops of your slides. It still allows the airflow to circulate here in the middle 
and then it keeps everybody cool, keeps everybody happy. Yeah, and it's very quiet as well. I know that these kind of keep the sound from the AC units down. We have the generator running right now. How, yeah. how is it so quiet in here? So typically, like if you go into any RV, you'll see a cutout there where an air conditioner is at. If you pull that screen, you'll see the motor. Where these air conditioners are completely outside the coach, they pipe in the cool air, then that way you're not getting that, that the sound from that motor. So just a very nice whisper quiet system. That way you don't got to turn the volume up on TV when the AC kicks in. Now for the kitchen, right? Yeah. We want to keep the yes, kitchen sir. fed. We want to keep we want to keep mama fed, papa fed. So this is where you do it. You start out with a beautiful Whirlpool refrigerator. It's got the water dispenser there, so it's going to be all filtered water. That way the kids are going to be nice and happy. Lots of storage in there. Basement freezer. You've got a nice little spice rack here, so a uh, nice little place to put your spices. And then nice Whirlpool convection microwave. You can bake cookies or you can cook a pizza. So what I like about these, you can both of these are going to have cutting boards in the stove top toppers. So I kind of like the, the fact that it's not just beautiful, but it's also practical. And then it also has this really nice induction cooktop. So let's just say it's a really nice day out and you want to cook some fish, but you don't want that smell of the fish to be inside the coach. Take your stove top. You can go cook it out there on the picnic table and just makes it a really nice function why you got your whole family surrounded with you you guys are just enjoying each other's company and you're not missing out being stuck in the coach cooking you can do it out there okay so cruising on through the kitchen here we've got a nice little bread box you can put your coffee pot in there it's got an outlet so you can't put like a little keurig or something that you want in there you've got really nice drawers here just awesome storage look how long those come out yeah deep drawer space and I've got to point a lot of remotes here in this, but yeah, I've got to point out the hardware on this and get everybody a close up, almost like a carbon fiber pattern on the hardware. Mm -hmm. Really a good look to it. Numar is known for the quality of their craftsmanship and woodwork. And I love the design on these slide faces. Yeah, all kinds of storage here. All so, soft closing drawers. Yeah, yeah, even in the Ventana, is soft close, is that an uh, option or is that standard? No, that's gonna be standard. Yeah, standard in a Ventana. Yeah. yeah, Ventana actually really stepped up its game. You're going to have uh, uh, dual stainless steel sinks. Yeah. Um, what I like about the Ventana, you move up into that bigger motor, right? It's still it's still an ISL 450 motor. So I mean, I'm sorry, 400, same motor, just tuned down. So uh, plenty of power, but you still get a lot of the nicer features that you used to see in the Dutch Stars. Yeah, stability of a tag axle coach. All right, so. Really nice features here, right? You want to cook the spaghetti? You can cook the spaghetti, right? No <laughs> yes, problem. Sir. We got really nice upper cabinets. And I like how they finish the wallpaper on the back of the cabinets there, and it's lined with carpet. This is a lot of the stuff that we're going to see in a high-end coach. And mm -hmm. can we open that up again? I just yeah, want to absolutely. see what the gross vehicle weight is of this coach. I like that they put the VIN number right here. If you want to look up the VIN number on this coach. And then the gross vehicle weight is only 44,700 pounds. It's is that being a um, being a triple slide, it's, it's a little bit lighter than some of the King Airs and London yeah, Airs and stuff. It sure is. Um, so typical, like I would say a lot of your King Airs are gonna be hitting that 53, 54,000 pound range. So uh, with this guy being so much lighter, it's still just an absolute joy to drive. Climbing them hills, no problem. Now, as we get the view going from the kitchen into the living room, just imagine family sitting around, just a nice, beautiful time, hanging out, just having a great time. And then just a nice little area here where we can all sit and watch TV. I don't know how there's this much area in the living space and still two bedrooms. Where, where are these yep. two bedrooms at, Lance? You want to show us? I will. So, But I, do we have storage over here first? We, we do. So I was, gonna, so I was gonna, as we were walking by this, We've got a little extra pantry space, and these are all adjustable, so if you want to get them taller items in there, no problem. Yes, sir. Um, and as we walk through here, now what I like, when you get into RVs and you're walking through a hallway, typically it's dark, right? But when you're walking through this one, look at these windows. you got great view. Guess where this is at? This is patio side. This is where all the family's hanging out. You can walk through here. you got a great, great view. Um, we actually have this emergency exit door. 
Yeah, that could be utilized for loading stuff into the back of the coach here as well. I really like that. Absolutely. Hey, hand me the toilet paper. I yeah. need the towels, right? The nice feature that I like is that you have all your friends and family, they're sleeping up there in the front. We got folks sleeping out there in the back, but just directly across from this emergency exit door is our second bedroom. So really nice if there ever is an emergency, you know, kids, you know, kids first, right? We get them and they're off to safety right out the door. So yeah, I'm a big fan of the egress door. Awesome feature to have. You want to show us this uh, second bedroom? You sure you want to see it? I'm excited. Never right. seen this before. Let's do it. Oh my gosh. It is super, it's chilled in here. <laughs> I'm sitting in a freezer right now and this feels so nice. It is nice and cold. We just yeah. turned this coach on and uh, it's just so nice to be able to come in here. It's nice and cool. Boy, the kids are going to absolutely love it. But as you can see, we got a couple of bunks. We do have a nice solid wood ladder here that hooks right here. You're going to have windows for both bunks. You got a uh, reading light. You got a 110 outlet with a couple of USB ports and the windows do open. Okay, yeah. So you can get some nice fresh air. And then if you come on in through this way, you've got some nice cabinet space. Here we go, we got some really nice cabinet space. And just look at how big this closet is. Yeah, plenty of wardrobe hanging space there. Lots and lots of wardrobe space. More drawers down low. Yeah. And then I like that, that both bunks have windows and emergency exits on the windows in the bunks too. Yep. Outlets, USB ports, a little uh, reading light. Uh, really nice drawers here. Little Samsung TV in the, in the bedroom here as well. Yeah, nice upper cabinet. One of the nice things I wanna point out too is I mean, yeah, you have the ability to open up windows, right? Get some fresh air. But what I really like is you can direct your air so you can point the air where you want it. So, you know, maybe they don't want the, the cold air. So they can just turn it and then have the air blowing in different directions but not blowing right on them in the box nice. so yeah now lance you want to show us uh do you want to test the bunks out for size oh, i'll do it yeah why not i know no. you had a knee injury uh recently but uh okay, so i'm six so let's six I, foot i'm six foot and i've got like probably another inch above my head so yeah and i'm i am completely yeah, I'm flat footed against the... You you think if you uh, you, if you needed to get a good night's rest, you could uh, get some sleep in there? I sure could. Now, like my buddy Matt's RV Review says, that room is not for the paying customers. That's right. <laughs> where, where, where do the paying customers get to hang out? Right this way, sir. So now as we venture down the hallway, just keep in mind the extra storage, right? I mean, here's the thing. They didn't have to put this in here, but anywhere you can store something, it's just, you know, maybe you got some board games. You just yeah. got stuff that you yes, want to store. Just absolutely nice. You got your central back located here, right? Um, so throw Let's away the dustpan. We'll do the bedroom and then go back to the bathroom. Now let's let's see the bathroom first. So I like more windows along the patio side. And if, and if this isn't the right coach for you, they do have a lot of selection here at uh, Trans West in Belton, Missouri here. Lance can help you out with those. That's but, uh, right. We actually have another Ventana bunkhouse. Uh, it has the dedicated bunks, but not a true two bedroom, just dedicated bunks. Now, before we go into the paying customer room, let's just show uh, the uh, nice master bathroom here. We got a beautiful, you know what? I think that might, that just might pass the. Yeah, I think, I think our buddy Matt, talking about our buddy Matt. Oh, that's the PPP for sure. Let's yeah. see here. Oh, look at all this room. <laughs> Fantastic. You know what? You need some TP, right? <laughs> I mean, it just doesn't get any better. You said uh, Matt would give that a pass for sure. But really a nice, you want to show us the uh, the shower test? I know yeah. you're not quite as big as yeah. Will, but uh, so let's see. So I'm going to step in here. Now this has a, a teak seat in here. So I'm going to step in here. Now I've got some, I got some width here. I, I mean, yeah, I don't want to tell you my pant size, but it's, hey, it's big. Lance, like, Lance just got married. Congratulations. Oh, yeah. Wife's uh, feeding yeah. you good. I'll tell you what. I'm a lucky man. Too blessed to be stressed. Let's just say that. Yes, sir. So anyway, give me a call, right? Because I got another mouth to feed. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, hey, sir. Uh, but anyway, you know, this shower, absolutely beautiful. Look at this nice, it has that nice part marble look. It does have the aqua view system in here. So it's just great for water conservation. If you're going to go out dry camping, you can preheat the water before it actually even comes out of the shower head. This is going to be adjustable. and. You're 6'2", look how high that shower head is. Oh yeah. That is gonna be no problem. And I bet you at least a seven foot person. <laughs> yes sir. Could be in here, no problem. 
So lots of room. And now, for all those gentlemen, ladies, you got a nice, if you just want to sit and you just want to soak, you're like, oh, right, rough day. <laughs> I love the grandkids, but man, I just, I need some time. So nice little just, teak seat. Yes, sir. Yeah, they actually have that set up pretty nice. I can't believe how much is packed into this coach. You know, where, where do the paying customers get to sleep? All right, well, that's going to be in here, and they're going to love it because they're going to get a beautiful king-size bed. So wow. just loaded with space. Now, I know a lot of customers, they don't like to get a coach unless it has opposing windows so they can get that nice cross ventilation. You're going to get that with this coach. You're going to have windows on both sides. Yeah, if you're laying down, yeah, you've got different ways to control this coach. You can turn on your different lights, reading lights, accent lights. Without ever seat. getting out of bed. Yeah, and there's another button there for security lights. So if you want to turn the outside lights on the coach to kind of illuminate it, you can. You've got 110 outlets on both sides. Now this is going to have um, an outlet in the cabinet, so you can see it right there. So if you have a CPAP, You've got your plug-in right there, and then over here, you've got a hole already pre-drilled so you can drop your hose. Nice. So just really nice. Um, then here, just at the foot of the bed, really nice, beautiful counter space, and a nice window. I mean, if you just think about it, you got a window from here all the way down this coach. So a lot of view out here on your patio side. And that's still a huge Samsung TV here in your bedroom. It's got to be yep. what a 32 inch at least. Or? That's going to be a 32 inch, and it's going to be a smart, smart TV. So every TV in here is going to be a smart TV. You can watch YouTube. You can watch Lance uh, at Transwest. We're going to do a bunch more videos here. Absolutely. So. so you can see that we have a safe in the in the closet. Okay, and then we got another one of those little ottomans. Yes, that sir. we saw earlier in the, in the bedroom or in the living room. Yes, sir. And then this is what I really like because I mean. There were some issues with some older models where you could, you'd go to the closet and you could see some of the like the wiring and all that. But I like that Newmar took the time to actually build some cabinet doors so you can actually oh, get yeah. a nice place to live. Yes, sir. Right. So um, they really stepped up their game. Now, just on the other end here, you do have a washer and dryer. It is going to be a Splendid washer dryer, stack washer dryer. And what I also like about this is you have an access panel right down here. So for any reason, you need to turn off the valve, the water system to that. You don't have to pull the washer out to get to it. All right, Lance, we need to talk money on this coach because I think someone out there is going to want to capitalize on this two full bedroom bunk model Newmar Ventana yep. why would somebody want to buy a Newmar product especially this one and why would they want to buy from you at Transwest here in Belton Missouri well uh boy there's just a handful of reasons I mean there was a when I I've been here for about two years almost three years two years seven months and I tell you what it was the best move I ever made um when I came here one of the things that Transwest focuses on is motorhomes we don't sell new travel trailers we don't sell new fifth wheels our focus is motorhomes, okay? And we're one of the largest Newmar dealerships in the United States. Now, with that being said, just to let you know, we have a full chassis shop. So we can go through the whole, we can make sure you're all your chassis is in good running order. And then we have a full RV facility that has master technicians, not just a certified RV technician. These are guys who work on those million and a half, two and a half million dollar coaches. We've got the right crew. And I tell you what, we will take really good care of you. If you've never purchased an RV out there, you can check all the forms out there. Newmar is one of the most reliable, robust motorhomes that are out there. Now, all the systems that are on this coach, they've been tried, they've been true, they've been battle tested. And one of the things that I like about Newmar is an ultra quiet cab when you're driving. So very comfortable. You got that tag axle that turns. You've got slides that recess inside the wall. So it helps cut down a lot of wind noise and you don't get a lot of cabinet chatter. So if you got friends and family here, they're playing games or maybe they have to do a little work, um, it's really nice and quiet in this cab while you're doing your traveling. So you take the Newmar, you take Transwest, you put us together and we deliver a really nice product for you. And guys, I would just be honored if I could help you in any way. Lance is one of the most knowledgeable Newmar reps I've ever met. So 
appreciate you sharing so much wisdom with myself and the folks out on YouTube. Now, if someone's a serious buyer and they want to purchase this coach, mm -hmm. how much money do you need and who should they get a hold of? So we're looking to get uh, 364 805 out of this coach. If somebody's a serious buyer and they're ready to step into this new Marvin Tana, who should they get a hold of? Well guys, uh, you can reach out to me. My name is, again, Lance, and you can contact me at 208-290-5750. I would be honored and privileged to be able to help you. If you guys have any questions, if you want to do a FaceTime video where we can spend a little bit more time with this coach, please give me a call. I would love to help you. Awesome, Lance. Greatly appreciate you and the team at TransWest. I also greatly appreciate all of you out there on YouTube subscribing to the channel and liking these videos. I hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again. Well, Andrew, big thanks for coming out today. And uh, everybody out there, stay cool. I look forward to hearing from you.